the Pennine Way, 268 miles of rugged terrain. Over the coming weeks, this will be home to these five clowns. Cobblers, a party clown from Glenroth. Happy, a circus clown from Southampton. Pop-up Polly, a party clown from Runcorn. Little Nick, a circus clown from Cheadle. And Tom Fun, a stage clown from Pennar. They will endure freezing conditions and hostile landscapes in the ultimate reality challenge. Day five. The clowns have overnighted at a self-catering cottage in Hebden Bridge. Is there a bin bag in this bin? No, is there, heck? And after five days, they are beginning to get on each other's nerves. If I had the choice to vote somebody off, and I'd like to nominate cobblers off and just to have a bit of peace because I'm finding him very in your face at the minute and I can't be doing with him getting too... I don't do well with people getting too close too quickly and I feel he's doing that with me. Ooh. That's an egg, then. <laughs> Tom Fun in particular is becoming more cantankerous by the day. Today's walk would have been a lot better had we done it after breakfast, when I had stoked up and had plenty of energy. I mean, the sandwiches I had lunchtime were not what I had asked for. <laughs> and I couldn't eat all of it. I'd asked for brown bread and I got white. Little Nick and Happy <laughs> attempt to lighten the mood with a box of modelling balloons. But if anything, the balloons have only added to Tom Fun's misery. Oh, oh. <laughs> Cold, you know. I've got no skills, you see. I've got to smile about it. I don't do balloons, I don't juggle. Later that evening, away from the others, Tom Fun finally has the chance to reflect. Hello. <laughs> May I? share with you a couple of poems called Why Be a Clown? Why be a clown? Who'd be a clown? I'd be a clown, just to fall down and to see all that laughter. But doesn't it hurt? <laughs> 